Okay, I'm gonna start off with the amphibian cage or tank, whatever. Let's see what I can find. Here's a little, I think it's a baby slider that I caught. It's pretty tiny. If you can see that. Ugly. There we go. So here's the tiny musk turtle that I caught. He is quite small. <laughs> I think this is the smallest turtle I've ever caught. So here's my salamander. Oh buddy, 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 buddy. As you can see, he's very, very active. I think he's a mud salamander. Or red salamander, I'm not exactly sure. I just threw it in there with all the other stuff. So far it's been okay. Here's a slightly bigger crayfish. Still pretty small though. Hey buddy, you wanna pinch me? I don't think he wants to pinch me right now. got this little salamander right here. I've got four of these. I just caught them in a little creek back here. They've got gills on the outside of their head. I'm not sure if it's aquatic or terrestrial. If you have any ideas, comment down below because I'm not the best at identifying salamanders. <laughs> here are my three little turtles. Wait, stay on. See there. Here's the musk turtle. Here's a slider, here's another slider. Here we go, three little turtles. Here's a little Mediterranean gecko, I think it is. It's really pretty. I haven't even caught really any geckos here. This is the first gecko and I actually didn't catch it, it just ended up in a bucket I had sitting around. So that was kind of neat. I'm gonna put him back in here. So first off we got this nice little, I think it's a female fence lizard because it doesn't have a blue belly. Really energetic though. Nice pretty fence lizard. Here's a little ground skink. I have four of these in the tank. I'm not sure how big they get, but yeah, that's a nice little find. And then here is my garter snake that I caught today. He bit me twice, so I'm hoping he's mostly tame now. But yeah, it's a cool little find. I know they're supposed to be certain, really common in certain areas, but for me, any snake is a cool snake, even if it is common. But I've actually never seen these before. This is the first one I saw in my area. So that's new, and this is the first snake I've tamed, so. I'm saying it's tamed, I'm hoping it's tamed, because it hasn't bit me again yet. So that's what I'm hoping, that he is tame. Because it'd be really cool, because then I can say I have a tame snake. That's a big skink. Yes, sir. Finally got him after a few tries. I didn't get it on camera, because I was too lazy to get my harness and chest strap and everything. I think it's a broadhead skink, as you can see the red, the head has a little bit of a red tinge, but I'm not exactly sure. Comment down below what you think this species of skink is. Look at that, that's pretty long. What do you think, six inch skink or something? Then I was bringing him home with a bunch of crickets, and then ten of the crickets got eaten. So. He got reasonably fatter. Those are my creatures that I have right now, and I hope to catch more soon. But yeah, <laughs> I'm 
Some people might just catch and release, but as of right now, I kind of want to keep some of them, just because you don't see these kind of creatures every day. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. I'll see you in the next video.